Hi everyone, this is Tammy from Creative Critters. I wanted to do a quick little video this morning to show you how I used Cricut Craft Room to do my font and my title page. Now, Cricut Craft Room has a feature that is a tab called Fonts, and under that tab you'll see there's Add a New Text Box, which is really cool. And how you use it basically is I put a text box in and I typed in my font, or my title, which is the word Aquarium, that this one is in... Um, birthday bash but I'm gonna add more because I like to layer so I'm gonna click off of the title so that it's no longer highlighted I'm gonna go over here and add a new text box when I click on that it brings a box up here and simply using my keyboard I'm gonna type in the word Atlantis okay now you see that it put it in at the very top um, don't worry about that just click done and it will give you these little handlebars around it so you can just take that and move it down and it's not overlaying what you already had in that place now you can see that I have the word Atlantis and it is in the same font that my other word was in which is birthday bash I'm gonna go over here and this is the part that I really like about create Cricut Craft Room is that I can click on this and this is going to drop down all of the font cartridges that I have and so I'm no longer having to search which ones have a font which ones don't have a font some are obvious some are not um, I can click on that font this is botanicals and look it changes it so that you can actually see what that word or what the title is going to look like in another font I can go down to carousel and it will change that one check that out isn't that awesome I love how it does that with this uh, with this feature this is something that you don't necessarily get in gypsy or design studio because you have to add each individual letter from whatever you're using so this is cherry limeade and so you can see that it's giving me a lot of different styles I can look and see what my word is going to look like I'm actually going to go and use I want something kind of piratey looking so I'm going to use black letter when I use black letter I'm going to click up here and say done it'll give me those handlebars and now I can adjust it I want this font to be about three inches in length I did not want it to be proportional so that's why I did not use that key and I can move it to where I need on the mat and then get ready to cut so that's pretty much how you do fonts um, in Cricut Craft Room I love the feature makes it easy and I can move it around on my mat now so that when I go to cut it it'll cut in the right place so thanks for watching I hope that helps you bye